before I begin this video, I want to thank a few people on the internet, which they're on both on YouTube and on Twitter. If you guys know me already, I'm the Twitter guy who's against feminist frequency. You know, anyone who just basically just flat out just say some stupid shit about feminist frequency. I feel like I need to point out, I feel like what they're saying is complete bullshit and just complete utterly nonsense. Just completely, just plain out white knighting. So the first one goes to Pixel Eyes. Now this one's on Twitter. I'm not sure if this person has a YouTube page or whatever, but Pixel Eyes is the one responsible to showing me some of these links, you know, of exposing Anita Sarkeesian. She, um, I found a link from that person. I'm not sure if this person's a he or she. I'm assuming it's a she because uh, due to her avatar, although, you know, then again, this is the internet. We, we don't really know for sure. Uh, what else? Yeah, Pixel Eyes have shown loads and loads of, um, screenshots of, um, you know, showing that Aeneas Sarkeesian is not in a non-profit organization. In fact, she's part of an She's actually working for profit. So, yeah, that seems to be quite suspicious. I also want to thank Jordan Owen42. Um, I subscribed to him about a few months ago where he made videos on Anita Sarkeesian. He made plenty of videos on Anita Sarkeesian. Almost as much as Warcorp 666, which, you know, I have to point out that Warcorp 666, uh, I'm surprised he hasn't said anything about this. Mainly, maybe because he doesn't go on Twitter very often. I, I need to show this to uh, Warcorp 666. I know, I know that Warcorp 666 is going to be completely overjoyed to hear that Aeneas Sarkeesian is actually a big ass fraud. And there's actually proof that she's a big ass fraud. I bet Warcorp 666 is gonna be the first, you know, it's gonna just take out a beer. I mean, this is not a beer, but this is soda. Drink it down. And say cheers. And he'd be completely overjoyed to hear this news. I know it. I know him very well. So. It's also, this is my thanks to Warcorp666 for making such wonderful videos. Um, and also, I want to thank Girl Does Rant again. You know, uh, she actually, the last video I made on Nina Sarkeesian, she uh, liked, she shared the video. I got a few subs here and there. So, thank you, Girl Does Rant. I really wish that we could make a collab video together. And, you know, let's see, what else? There are other people on Twitter that, you know, supported me. Um, you know, they, they got my back. I mean, I only have about 11 followers on Twitter. But by the time I'm done with this video, I may end up having more. Or less. So, let's begin. Now, I do apologize for this very low-res screenshot. I am very, very sorry. Very, 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 very sorry. But, you know, links in the description. If you want to look for yourself, that's fine by me. But if you don't want to do it, that's fine. That's fine. You know, no biggie. Um, <sighs> this screenshot is basically showing uh, Aeneas Sarkis in being part of a corporation. Basically, she's not working for free. She's doing this shit for money. I mean, just look at the fucking description. <sighs> and if that's not enough, uh, if you scroll down, you would also find out that Anita Sarkeesian in California, right now in California, is not in part of any 
any nonprofit organizations, which is odd because she says that she is a part of a nonprofit organization. And yet, here she is being a part of a nonprofit organization. Remember that none of this shit, none of this shit is photoshopped. This shit is real. You can take a look for yourself. Look at the descriptions. Do a little bit of research, and you'll find out that Anita Sarkeesian isn't who she says she is. I wouldn't be a fucking... I mean, I wouldn't be so fucking surprised if it turns out that she's an alien or some sort. Or maybe she's the fucking devil. I don't... Either way, it wouldn't surprise me. Now, um... If you remember my last video on Ia Sarkeesian, it was about her stealing artwork from a, a guy named Cal Kitty of Princess Daphne. And um, Ia Sarkeesian, you know, personally apologized towards Cal Kitty, but Cal Kitty wants the picture to be either be removed or at least give, you know, give credit towards Cal Kitty. Uh, Ania Sarkeesian refuses because the picture was under fair use. Bullshit. The picture is not under fair use. This is his artwork. Or her artwork. I'm not sure about his gender. I'm assuming it's a he. Um, but Princess Daphne. I mean, not Princess Daphne. Cow Kitty has, you know, spent time and effort making that drawing that Ania Sarkeesian has not, is, hasn't drawn herself. She, she is basically making money off of his artwork. So that could lead into, he can sue him. I mean, sue her for using art, his art to gain money. And remember that she's part of an organization. She's part of a company. She's not doing this for nonprofit. And the sad thing is, there are still Anita Sarkeesian fans defending Anita Sarkeesian, even to his day. It's just really sad to see. If Anita Sarkeesian is really part of a non-profit organization, and she was really true to her word, she would not have to lie to her own fans. She would not have to manipulate them. She would not have to resort to such tactics as to silencing other YouTubers, ignoring their, ignoring them completely. Just flat out, this is just flat out evil. You know, Anita Sarkeesian has abused you. She has taught you a lie. She has given you false, false evidence about the gaming industry. She is nothing more than a fraud, a living fraud. She is no better than Andrea Richards, who is far worse than Ania Sarkeesian, in my opinion. Although, she's, she's getting there. She's really getting there. Sarkeesian fans, it's time that you realize that you've been played like a fiddle. Ania Sarkeesian is dishonest. And ask yourself the question, would you really want to donate to someone who is dishonest? I mean, she lied about her being a gamer. She has stolen Let's Play clips. She's stolen art. She apparently is a part of an, a company and she's not a part of a non-profit organization. She lies about the gaming industry. She supports the death of a C, uh, of the Gearbox CEO in a, in, a, in a fanfic and she is a hypocrite because she apparently removed a game from Newgrounds that's all about beating up Anita Sarkeesian. That is seven deadly sins right there. 
Sarkeesian fans, it's time that you realize the errors of your ways of supporting this demon. Anita Sarkeesian is living proof of the possibility of the devil existence. And if it's true, then I am no longer an atheist. I will have to give up my atheism if this turns out to be true. So Feminist Frequency fans and people who really hate Feminist Frequency, I suggest that you spread these links all around to people like Mr. Repsion, the Amazing Atheist, Movie Bob, yes, those people who've white knighted Anita Sarkeesian, such as Movie Bob, uh, what, what's his face, what's his face, ooh, Moist Rebel News, um, what else, what else? Oh yes, Angry Joe. Yes, send this shit to every Anita Sarkeesian supporter and those who've made videos white knighting feminist frequency, including Angry Joe. This shit needs to be exposed because Anita Sarkeesian is not, is not gonna get away with this. It's time that Anita Sarkeesian has paid for her actions. And if she doesn't wanna confront them, that it will be her own burden. This will be the downfall of Anita Sarkeesian. This will end feminist frequency. So, spread the word. I am the Atheist Gamer. Peace. The